Christmas! Yeah, Christmas today everyone. I hope everyone is having a great day today. I hope you got everything you wanted and I hope that everything went well for you today. I just want to make something up, make something up though. Um, well, bring something up. First of all, we've got to remember that we've got to be thankful for what we've got as well as people we're with. And I'm really glad to be with people that I know and to also have friends that are definitely there. Because this year has proven who my friends really are. This year has proven who my friends really, really are. Who stuck by me and supported me through the tough times. But that's another story. Um, coming back to what I was going to say. Um, first of all, um, this is just a video on... For everyone basically Yu-Gi-Oh! Lakana that's what I'm just gonna upload it, actually video games you can always um, subscribe to my video gaming channel it's in the description below in the link tree and um, first of all I want to say to Yu-Gi-Oh! players thank you so much for all your support you guys have been absolutely amazing the at first we started it we still are going back to I mean next year I'm Starting Jan, I am going to try and get... I'm going to get back to Ultimate TCG. There's been a while since I've been down there. Obviously, I've had a lot of Saturdays where... Somebody has asked me, do you want to do this? And it's been like, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna do it. And, you know, not blaming, by the way. There's no blame there. It's just, I just wanted to do something different. Um, I'm going to be taking a Wednesday off as well. But starting the 3rd of January... I'm going to go back to normal, and then it'll be 4th, 5th, 6th, um, and that's when I'll get back to Ultimate TCG. And it's going to be like, I'm going to start looking at, not every two weeks, but because I'm at a locals, I can go there every week. But for another place, it will have to be maybe every two weeks. Um, so at least then I'm not stopping it entirely. Um, I'm actually fluctuating between filming and taking a break because if I film edit one day off film edit one day off it and it's not really doing much at the moment so I don't want to burn myself out but apart from that with the Child Christian series ended we've also got other people who want to be on the TV table originally it was a bit like am I on TV table am I on TV table now it's do you want me on the TV table and that really makes me happy to hear because the fact is it's it's not just that we do the TV table for, you know, my personal, it's nothing like that. It's also for us to have a laugh and to show that everyone at the shops just, we all want to have fun. And, you know, it gives the shops um, some exposure as well. But not just that as well, but if people wanted to watch the games, they could think, hang on, maybe I should have done it this way. You know, you might think, hang on, you couldn't have done that. You know, there's a bit like, say, you, say a guy played Cyber Dragon. They summon Core and chose not to use its effect. There's a misplay, because Core is a mandatory effect. And on my cybers. <laughs> but, you know, we want to also just show kids that we can all have fun playing Yu-Gi-Oh! than just, oh, we play meta. We play serious. We can also play meta and have a laugh. Um, coming back to other shops as well, I'd like to travel a bit more. I went to Grim Dice this year, which was an awesome place, by the way. Really cool people. I would love to go back there again. Lace Dragon Gaming, really sound guy who works there and really sound people. And, you know, having one of their top players for the Nationals at 2014... On the TV table. I felt really cool to hear that. And it was great. Um, I kind of wish I faced him though. <laughs> but that's the thing. Um, sometimes it happens. Sometimes it doesn't. I just want to say though. That there is something I would like to say though. And that is that. You know. Level of support in the Yu-Gi-Oh community. Has been absolutely amazing. Really brilliant. So we are still going to continue making videos. We are still going to have other people take board. Jowie's not 100% gone. 
he's just taking a break. So if I wanted him down, it's up to him. But if he's up for it, he could say to me, hey, dude, I'm up for coming down next week. Yeah, okay, bring him down. But that's, you know, I have to, I would have to, like, move the three people, move forward. But if anybody else wants to be part of it, feel free to be part of it. But you've got to be a local. You can't just be, oh, I'd like to be part of it, and you're from Kent. You know, because it'd be like, wait, how are you going to get here? You know? <laughs> um, obviously, I will have a backup just in case. So if one person says I want to be on and they can't make it because they're ill, I'll have somebody else on. We've always got backups. The next thing as well is that apart from me traveling, um, I'm also going to be putting my Yu-Gi-Oh stuff away, which means I won't be playing for a while. In fact, I won't be able to lend cards for a while. But that doesn't mean it's going to be forever. I need to sort my folders out because a lot of cards I still have. And I haven't even sorted them for a while. So they need to get back in the folders. They really need to. But also, one other thing as well is... I also want to get out GOAT and Edison decks. You know, maybe do more time with the defense. That'd be cool. Um, at the moment, though, I ain't going to go mad on it just yet. So, with that being said... That's all of Yu-Gi-Oh! at the moment. Jowie's gone, so Drag Russian series is definitely over. Never going to come back. But other people will still be on the TV table, so it's not the end. The content will still keep going. Keep going. EDO Pro replays, we will still continue to do them. I'm currently working on Crystal Beasts. Um, so I think I'm going to have to get in contact with Neshi, see if we can do something. Because um, I would like to try out that a crystal room well crystal beast type deck um almost give oh, actually give that away <laughs> um but there's also the fact that there's video pro replays deck profiles that i would like to do but deck profiles will be a little bit difficult for wednesdays saturdays might be okay OTSs, we can still do them now that's all for Yu Gi Oh for lakana I would like to say also thank you again for the people who supported me. Um, Lucana hasn't been quite easy to make content for. And that's more because of products. However, I've heard now they're starting to do more with it. Get more printed out. Which means scalpers are going less and less. Which is great to hear. And what that means is I can actually start doing more openings. Such as Lucana Chapter 3. Troves, gifts, well, say, yeah, gift sets, um, starter decks. I'd like to do more of them. Deck profiles will still go. For matches, though, like I said, if I'm doing Saturdays off one week, I can go to Lacana and make content there for matches. So it's a bit of a, it's a mix, basically, which is not the worst. It's actually not too bad. So that's a plan for Lacana. I'm not traveling anywhere just yet, though, for that. For Lacana, if I wanted to travel, um, I'd have to be, it has to be a bit more than just, do you want to come? That's it. It's got to be a bit more. But for Yu Gi Oh!, I love making content for that. That's my main priority. So that's the plans for the channels of Lacana and Yu Gi Oh! Yu Gi Oh! will not change, it will be the same. It's just that the Jail Christian series will be the end. So Jerry playing bad, well, decks that either I made or someone else made is officially gone. It's officially gone. We also don't want another Sunrika issue. <laughs> Never again. I had to talk to someone about that and they said it's disgusting what the comment section was like. Um, but I said don't, don't make a video on it. Just, you know, because we're not going to play. And they said no, just I want you to keep playing, which we did. We still kept going with it, but it just it just got to a point where it's like it wasn't going through anyone's head. So we just thought, nah, drop it. But apart from that, that is it. So, last thing I want to say is, if you want to keep up with what I do, please follow me on my Twitter. You can check me out on Twitch. They are in my, in the link tree. 
description to mark uh, down there. Let's word that better. They are in my link tree in the description below. Um, other websites as well. That, well, other social media sites you can check out as well. And above all, that is it. Um, I am going to do one last stream for at the end of the year. So it will probably be on the 29th or the 30th. So if you want to be part of it, please give that follow button a follow on Twitch. In the meantime, you all take care. And I'll see you all very soon. Have a good Christmas. Have a good New Year.